hi. Before we get into this awesome video, nerd, look at our lovely cabin that we're staying at here in New Hampshire. Isn't it wonderful? So I want to talk a little bit about nerd to me. When I first got back into the hobby, moved back from Hawaii, Kevin's book on ball pythons was one of the books I first found and read and went through and that's where I found Freedom Breeder was in Kevin's book. So not only is Nerd an iconic place for me and lots of other reptile keepers, uh, it has a very special personal meaning for me to actually come out here and finally do this trip and, and see this place. So I just wanted to say that before we get into this video because I thought that was important to say. And there you go, there you have it. Let's uh, get into what is going to be a two-part video and a very needed break, because at this point, I still don't have the results for Sunset. As I'm sitting here right here, I'm still waiting for a call from the doctor to figure out what's going on for our indigo snake. So this was a very much needed distraction while I wait, and kind of the perfect thing. And that we have a very fun video plan for you. Two-part video, let's get into it. <laughs> Aloha! No time like the present. We're here at Nerd. Jeremy's gonna give us a little like tour-ish of. I didn't even know you were starting. I don't. I don't let people know. Remember, I do things without asking. We've already learned this. Oh I, yes, this is I true. I stuck my sticker on the uh, incubator refrigerator without. I don't. I didn't even have my lighting right yet. My thing was I want to find out exactly how many rooms there are here at Nerd. Like, like well, I want to count. I want to go. You want to count? Remember, I want to. I'd like to go to each room. Okay. And find the coolest thing in that room and feature that thing. So we can oh, okay. do, a, do a count. Oh, yeah. So let's just start with well, room number one. Okay, well, room number one, we don't go in because it's. Room number one, room. we don't go in. Yep. All right, <laughs> room number two, here we go. All right, so room number two. This is a room, it has retics. It's got retics. We've got green anacondas in here. Uh, most of the retics in here are gravid currently, so. Um, a lot of them are on heat. So this is a calico cow reticulated python. What's up, Kev? Hi, How you doing, bro? Hi. Hey, if you need some help with anything at any point, man, I, I'm not afraid of work, okay? I'm trying to talk to Hi. 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 It should be. It should be. But it could be yours. It could if, be mine. If, if you give us the cash first. <laughs> oh, he hasn't, he hasn't, he just kind of claimed it hasn't paid for it yet? I don't know. That's a Kevin thing. But. Oh, okay. So okay. as far as I'm concerned, no money's changed hands, but. <laughs> well, I do have a fairly large pocket for jeans that are kind of, they're large. They, are they large? They're, they're large pockets. Like 1990s large deep right. pockets? Okay. Everything I do is 1990s. Uh, yes, I'm about it. <laughs> but they only have 35 cents in them. I really would love to keep a monitor lizard just because of how, I mean, if you train it right, like Kevin does, it becomes like kind of like a dog, right? Oh yeah, we'll, we'll get the chance to play with some really big ones that are uh, basically like giant puppies. Oh, that sounds like, that sounds like fun. That was room six, and we filmed all of this in chronological order and numerical order. Kevin's sure. working too hard again already. Kevin, I'm this is down. all Kevin's room. So okay. <laughs> I'm calming down, look at that big lens. <laughs> Room number this is room three. Big box. Oh, this is room number three. This is Again, room number three. all of this has been filmed in chronological numerical order. We haven't edited try. at all. It smells. It smells in here. It smells like retake. <laughs> I keep retakes, and I've never smelled anything other than sunshine or rainbows, Jeremy. Yeah. Yep. Well, you haven't been keeping the right retakes. <laughs> Oops. Oh, you know what, dude? I think that. Did you? Did you? Or did we not feature this when you guys came to? Tinley. We featured this, yeah. We featured yep. this snake, right? Yep. He's a lot bigger now. Yeah, he's a lot bigger now. This is great. I'm gonna see if I can find that clip of, oh, see if I can find, I'm gonna put the clip right now of this snake the first time we filmed him yep. on this channel. Mini Moo. Ah, that's so cool that this is the animal, that you, the first animal you grabbed out of room number three. Room three, <laughs> Mini Moo. Coolest little dude in the room. Look at how, Beautiful, he's become. That is the nicest ball python I have ever seen. Oh, you bastard. It's the rainbow. <laughs> it's the rainbow. The ball oh, he's, he's whispering sweet nothings in my ear. We 
going into the room with no number, so keep that in mind when we're counting later. And by the way, the room with no number is huge. All right, so <laughs> we're, we're, we're just gonna, like, if you, if you can, and if it does strike, that direction. Okay. <laughs> okay. You, you, Hillary, did you, did you, did you see that, Hillary? Let's you do see what this. Dave said. So the Hillary, thing... if Brian dies, I'll we'll we'll take care of you. Where's Tyler Nolan when you need him? Oh, he is ornery. Oh, he's horrible. And he's probably gonna come out and hit the floor because he does not stay on the. Oh, I'm working. Oh, beautiful. That's what I like. Wait a minute, that was like the most anti-climatic thing that happened. I am glad. <laughs> Uneventful, that's what we wanted. Uneventful. I am oh, so man. glad. There you go. That's it, dude. That's it. We're all about efficiency here. <laughs> Alright, so we Okay, so moving on to room number four. Room number four. Titties. 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 Go! Other ask, than ask Kevin's titty. Ask, ask, dude, his ponytail really is the coolest thing in the world. <laughs> I like, uh, um, I, I like, uh, cowrie ticks. <laughs> cowrie ticks. Well, I just love cowrie ticks. That's a big, fancy cow right there. So this is the, this that's is the one original, of the first. That's the original mama. This is the original cow. Yep. And when we hatch those out, we're like, uh, I'm making these white snakes. And then we'll, shortly after they started getting all their blotches and all that kind of stuff. And they vary a great deal. So if I take a younger cow, we have the original males too, but this is like a younger cow and they get more blotching. So that's the golden child that really gives them that dark. Gotcha. But uh, everything's and, like and shedding. This one, this one is straight cow? This is all, so this is a uh, phantom. Orange star stripe. stripe, and this is Golden Child. Okay, okay. Is this and one Golden Child? Yeah, or that this one's one is. But they're all, as, as you know, they're all different. Now we're going into room number five. Bradley is also filming here for his channel. I'm gonna put a link down in the description for Bradley's videos okay. right. and his channel if you haven't followed him already. But right. Bradley, we have, we have Bradley to thank for this trip. So if there was no Bradley, there'd be no nerd trip right now. So thanks Bradley. You're welcome, Brian. All right, room five. So room five is kind of a smattering of different stuff. Like we've got a beaded lizard right over there. Um, we've got some blood pythons in here. We've got some raise up ball pythons in here, but probably the coolest animal in the room because I know you're going to want to see it. Oh, oh good Lord. God. <laughs> it's a bowling Dude. python. <laughs> Wait, what are we doing in here? Um, having python? an oh amazing time. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Can I just get in here real quick? Wow, Dave. Wow. Just wow. Dave Dude, this, Kaufman, ladies and gentlemen. Dude, this thing is gorgeous. Look at that. Oh, man. You can, hey, you know you can drag stuff so into another jealous. room so you can okay, cool. film and all that? Quite possibly the coolest snake here at Nerd at this point. I don't know. There's, I don't know how many rooms there are. That's the whole point of this video, right? We're going to find out how many rooms there are here at Nerd. But this room also has a nice floor, I'd like to point out. Isn't, isn't it beautiful? A lot of hard work just went into this floor. Almost as much work as how it's me doing this position right here. Ready? Planking with the bowlins. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's, oh, it's hard. Planking with the bowlins. <laughs> you know about planking. Apparently now Kevin's ass is implanted into my ass for... Dude, it looked like a good place to Dude. sit. <laughs> it's, it's, it's a fecal transplant. So generally I wouldn't lay on a floor. <laughs> but, but since this floor is so fresh and clean, I figured it's a good... And it's also a good angle for you guys to see this amazing snake. Look at that snake, dude. Just look at it. Are you looking at it? Oh, it's right away. You guys need to look harder. Hey, <laughs> 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 
Give us some Bolin Python facts. Bolin's uh, Python facts. So I'm gonna do that on my video. So if you want to see that, tune in to. Hey, hi, buddy. No, I will. <laughs> uh, Bolin's Pythons are from a area of the world called New Guinea. Uh, they are a montane species, which means that they live on the mountains and well, on the top of the mountains and the you know kind of just on the top of the mountains and on a little bit of the side of the top of the mountains. They're really inaccessible to get to. And I know a lot of researchers that have gone to New Guinea to you know, try to find these guys in the wild uh, and, and study them have had a really hard time because they not only need to go through those jungles, but they need to climb those mountains. And so because of its inaccessible range, not a lot is really known on these pythons as opposed to other species of pythons. Um, simply because studying these guys in the wild is, you know, really difficult. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen. That was not rehearsed or practiced. The guy knows his stuff. What can I say? Dun, 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 dun. Thank you, Wikipedia. <laughs> <laughs> and on that note, we're going to pause right there and pick up with the second half of the how many rooms are there at Nerd and all the coolest animals in the nerd facility on Monday. So thank you very much for watching part one. Stay tuned for part two. Uh, you guys take care of yourselves, take care of each other, and we'll see you for part two of the video the day after tomorrow. Thanks again. If you're watching this a couple days late, then hey, it's, it's already out and you're ready to go. Thanks. Hey, fantastic. See you soon.